Yo, what is up everybody? I'm out on the lake here. There is not a house to be seen in sight. Uh, I believe all the houses had to be off. It is March. It is March. Fifth, sixth, somewhere around there. But what I'm doing today is I'm out in this area here, old pan fishing. Now I know that there are schools of bluegills out here with crappies mixed in. Crappies are pretty nice size. What I want to do is I want to specifically pull those crappies out of the schools of bluegills. And I'm I'm honestly not thinking I'm going to come out and hammer, you know, a ton of crappies. I just feel like I can come out and pick a few of them off. And uh, yeah, just go find these schools of bluegills jig on top of them and try to pull these crappies out. Anyway, what I'm doing today, I have this four millimeter jig right here, made from RBM jigs, Lake Effect Lures, and something else right here, see that right there? This is the Fish and More one and a half inch minnow. Yep, I saw it and I thought limited edition or limited quantities, I'm gonna give it a try. Uh, this is named after Murray, Mr. Fishmore himself, this guy, like right here. We are gonna see how well these things work on these crappies. So it's a one and a half inch minnow, here with that four millimeter jig. And I'm just gonna hop around these bluegills and see if we can pull these crappies off with this bait. And we are gonna try that uh, right about now. Let's uh, start looking for these fish. Going down again. Ooh, here we go. Here's that's crappy. Come on, buddy. Right? Did we pick off a nice crappy. Yeah. Yeah, we did. Oh boy. Freaking dude, what a toad. I knew it. I knew it. Nice big bait like that. Cut a couple bluegills that were decent size, but I knew it would pick off a freaking big crop if it came to and down to it. Come on, get this guy out of here. Like so there we go. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at that toad. Whoo, baby. Ooh, there's a crappie. Crushed it. Right at the top of that school, too. Come on, another nice one. Oh yeah, another nice crappie, you guys. Look at that. Bottom jaw hooks, hook on that guy. Another beautiful slab of rooski, you guys. Look at that. Get him back down there. He come up and just pummeled that thing. Like I said, I was just been fishing the top of the school, trying to get these crappies out of here. Got a few bluegills. Not not very many crappies, but the ones we're getting are quality fish, which is nice. Another crappie. Double or two in a row. Ooh, this one feels good. Come on now. This one feels really nice. Oh, the old bull whip, putting it on him. Is this a, gosh, is that a crappie or we got a big old tulipy or something on here, you guys? This might be a tulipy, the way it's shaking its head. Oh my gosh, it's a monster crappie. It is an absolute donkey. Oh my gosh, look at that fish. Holy crap. That thing is an absolute toad, me, you guys. I don't have a bump around me, you guys, but I'll gear, I'll bet, I'd say it's 14 and a half. Could be wrong. I know it's 14 plus anyway. Woo. 
get out of here. Wow. Mmm. Oh, that was a big crappie. You guys, and I messed it up. Darn it. Oh, I messed it up. It was a big crappie, too. I know it was. There's one. There's a crappie. Oh, dude, he come up. He went up after it, back down. And then he come up and just smacked it. Another good fish. Look at the head shakes on this crappie, you guys. Oh, give me another good fish, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, another good crappie. Beauty. Look at how he just inhaled that thing, too. Ooh, got to get up the old pliers again. There we go. There she is. Just another beauty. Gosh, that's probably a, I don't know, 12 and a half or so, if I had to guess. Let's put it back down there, see if we can get another one. I'd like to get another absolute monster, like the one we got earlier. There's another crappie. They are just coming out of this school, you guys, of bluegills, and just putting it on this thing. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Boom. Another crappie, you guys. Look at that. Mission accomplished with this bait. Let them go. We're letting them go. What are the chances another one just sitting down there waiting to peel out of that school of bluegills? Okay, come on. Looking for the big crappy again. Ooh, there's a crappie, right? Oh, right off the bat, you guys. I lost one. Darn it. Oh, I felt solid, too. He just come ripping up out of that school of fish. There's a crappie again. This one doesn't feel that big. First one felt a lot nicer. Yeah, a little crappie. A little crappie, but nonetheless... The target species. That first one had some weight to it. Come on. So bad I just hate cleaning my holes out. Going, we're going back for Big Papa. I know he's down here. There's crappy. Another crap, another crap. The colors on these fish are just wild. Ooh, look at that guy. Beauty. And he's got some serious stuff going on with his mouth here. Look at that. Not sure what's going on, but we're gonna let him go. There he goes. Little bait is working wonders. I think the last, I think the last four or five fish I've caught now are actually crappies. Oh, big crappie, and I missed them. Gosh, you guys, I set that hook, hook way too hard. Way too much weight there. I gotta loosen up my drag here a little bit. Big fish. Oh, I botched it. There's a crappie. 
There's a nicer crappie. Nice slight hook set on that bad boy. Ooh, come on. Big. Big. Big daddy. Come on up here, buggy. Big crappie, you guys. Big, big, big. Here we go. Another tanker right in the top of the mouth too with that four millimeter that's glow pink glow tiger I believe on that jeez exactly what we're looking for exactly what we're looking for you guys let's let them go there's a nice crappie there's a crap gosh a little too much slack on that guy. Ooh. Ooh. Is it a crappie or is it a tulipy? This thing's really going to town here. What do we got? Nice crappie, you guys. Big, 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 big. Come on, come on. Big. Mongosaurus Rex, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that, right in the tip of the nose. Got us a beauty. Beauty, you guys. Whew. Probably a 13 incher. Just a solid tanker of a crappie. Gone. There's a big fish. I don't know if this, is, if this is a crappie or not. That was solid weight when I set the hook. Big. Oh, it is a crappie and it's a monster. Oh my gosh. Freaking giant, boys. Giant. Oh my gosh, that's got to be 14 plus. Got to be 14 plus. Okay, you guys. I'm breathing heavy. Ran back, found my catch board here. Fourteen, fourteen incher tanker boys. Wow. Okay, fourteen incher going back. What up? <clears throat> So today I think was a was a, just a, a great success, you guys. Came out here with plans to try out this uh, fishing more minnow. You'll have to go to his page, look this look this guy up. But uh, yeah, I think it's designed by Murray himself, or unless, unless he helped design it. But I seen it one day for sale or something, and I said, you know what? Let's see if that works. See, it's a gimmick. See if it does, if see if it's not a gimmick, but it certainly crushed some giant crappies there, you guys. Faux show. There, that bait is right there. It's the original one that I put on. It's an inch and a half long. Then I got that uh, four millimeter jig gun from RBM Jigs, Lake Effect Lures. I believe I have three pound frost line on here. 36 inch tuned up custom rods bull whip. Um, I had to I had to loose my drag a little bit, you guys. Those big those big big crappies. You set the hook on one, and you're not careful. Guess what you're gonna do? You're gonna rip the hook out, and that's pretty much what happened on a couple of mine. But remedy that. Okuma Seamar C10 reel. Decided to bust out the old Markham MX7 today. Haven't used that a lot this winter on videos. Oh, and then my drill. I took my little plastic plate off here, so I'm gambling, but I got a Milwaukee drill with the six inch Eskimo pistol bit. Thing rips through the ice. My preferred way to target panfish, you're gonna have to get a crappie, you know, over 15 to not get them through the hole. So if I do plan on doing that, I got the Eskimo 
eight inch pistol bit and I also have the Ion Alpha Plus. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that video. One note, targeted specifically crappies in these schools of bluegills. There was way more bluegills, hundreds, thousands of bluegills mixed in with these few crappies. Big bait like that, up above the top of the school jigging. We got some big crappies. I don't know, I actually found, found my bump board. The biggest one I measured was 14. Other one I would say was that caliber, right around there, maybe more. But anyway, you guys, hope you enjoyed another video. I'm gonna try and get out and make some stuff. Um, I don't know, it's been in a slump, slump lately. Um, trying to get back in the groove, and today certainly helped a lot. I'm gonna head back out to Devil's Lake here in a couple weeks and hopefully get some more video for you guys, maybe perch, maybe walleye more pike i don't know open water maybe i'll hit pool four of the mississippi with my buddy mike and tony i'm not sure but appreciate all the views you guys please please like share subscribe peace out